All right, everybody. CryptoVin here, CryptoVin YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Much appreciated. Doing another Gareth Soloway video. In this video, Gareth is doubling down on his NVIDIA price prediction. And guess what? Wrong again. This was done June 1st, interview done by David Lynn. I don't know why he keeps having Gareth on his show. Just repeatedly gives bad predictions. Let me know what you think in the comments section. Should David Lynn keep having Gareth on the show? And if you like this kind of content, guys, you like the gurus getting called out on their horrible price predictions, give me a like, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. That way you get notified of my uh, videos as soon as they come out. All right, let's see what Gareth has to say about NVIDIA this time. Again, June 1st, this was taken. Let's hear what he has to say. Yeah, yeah. And there's no doubt, doubt about it, right? I mean, so so if you just look at the metrics of it, trading at the PE, the forward PE, even if they were to get what they're proclaiming they're going to get from AI in the next year, my guess is it's going to take five to 10 years to really build it out. But, you know, the chart at this stage is in ludicrous land. Um, the one thing to point out here is if we look at the chart, this candle right here, which occurred three days ago, that's called a topping tail. And again, when it when you have a topping tail where you have a tail on the top and a close in the lower portion, on a technical basis, that's a sell signal. As long as you do not close above the high, which was around 420, that again is a sell signal on the chart. So the chart is saying sell. The fundamentals are saying sell. Right now, you have risk appetite, but my guess is that's going to fade when we start to see this economy slide more so into or towards a recession. All right, guys, this this topping tail he keeps talking about, he said that same thing when the video was $240 said the same thing about the topping tail and how it was going to go to, uh, you know, $185 or whatever he said, but he said it uh, or was going to go down to $240. I forget what the price was, but I did a video on it. Um, you could uh, check out that video. I'll leave it here uh, at the end of this video. So stay tuned and you can see what I'm talking about. But he says the topping tail. And again, this topping tail uh, again is wrong. And we're going to go to another part of the video, which was at about 6 minutes and 40 seconds. And hear what Gareth has to say here. We can move on. Most people have no clue that in 2023, the best way to make money on Amazon is not with to some other stocks as examples. But let's take a look at this one first. If you were just to look at the chart, uh, you know, how how overstretched is it right now based on the technicals? Yeah, so based on the technicals, it's in the, what we would consider the stratosphere, almost almost unparalleled in terms of history for such a large company. Now, you could have small mid-cap companies where they're much tinier, have great news, and they'll have these meteoric runs. But just to show you some cool technicals here, take a look at this, right? If we use a parallel and we do cool technicals like his topping tail has been so successful with NVIDIA a parallel line down here and we kind of do it in this lower range look at what happens when we raise it up here right so you basically if you go back to 2019 the lows on nvidia connected to the lows that we had in early 20 or late 2022 and you connect that to the high here you basically are at the upper band of a channel which again signals resistance you tap into the daily chart with the topping tail as well again doesn't guarantee it's topped but for my world it's all about probabilities i want to be the casino i don't want to be the gambler and in this case the the casino is is the higher reward or the higher success rate would be to the downside here. And so guys, he doesn't want to be a gambler yet. He's wrong twice. And using the same technical uh, analysis he's been using. So it's looking like he is the gambler and not the casino. Um, what a lost huge money on this one. It's kind of funny. David Lynn looks like he's picking his nose there little comedy there for you. All right, let's go to the chart here in the video. Uh, the, the, this video was taken July 1st. It was about $400 a share. This was seven months ago, so well past what a swing trader would hold something for. So you're looking at it about right here or so, and you can see $400, and right now we're at about almost $600. So you would have 
missed a two, uh, 50 percent move in nvidia if he listens to gareth in his awful predictions using awful technical uh, analysis the topping tail was wrong again this is the second time he's done it make sure you check out my video on that i'll leave it here uh, so you can see it and click on it for yourself and let me know what you think in the comments section have you used gareth's uh, services what uh, was your experience with that um, not looking good to me it looks like gareth is actually the gambler and not the casino all right subscribe guys hit that notification bell and we'll see you on the next video crypto vin out